my slippers. Have I not deserved my slippers? Of course you've deserved them alongside the rest of your expensive tre treasures. I never got the chance to enjoy my whole lifetime. What has gotten so into you that you insult all my wealth and my estate? You constantly banter and complain about your lifestyle to me. While I would die for a life like yours. Oh, Eliza, I have never thought about it like that. Of course you haven't, Higgins. You're surrounded by so much wealth that has made you a blind man. I have nothing. I grew up in a small family that couldn't even provide for one another. Selling flowers was all we were good for. What am I supposed to feel? Nothing, just nothing. You're a selfish man. I wish you would have just left me on that corner when you first discovered me. You ignorant human being. Have I not done anything for you? You have all this talk about me being the selfish one when it has been you that has been selfish all along. I heard your prayers, Higgins. Thank God it's all over. Well, don't you thank God it's all over? Now you can do what you would like. I have nothing to do with my life. My entire wardrobe that I had was filthy and not even fit for a lifeless corpse. This brand new wardrobe you awarded me with is unlike anything I've ever had before. I'm nothing. Every morning before school, I would walk up and down the sidewalk and glance into the clothing store of my town. We never had money to afford any of those garments, but I still dreamt of wearing them one day. All my riches, Eliza, mean nothing without the hard work that I have put in behind it. My families were hardworking people, you know. Growing up, growing up as a young boy, I was constantly living in the haves and the haves not time frame. I guess for someone that has had it all, like myself, I can never imagine myself in a haves not lifestyle. You see, you see, Higgins, you've never had it all. You are playing a role of someone you have created for yourself. In theory, all this wealth you sit upon means nothing. You're a cruel and lifeless character that smooches off of people to get what you want. Really, all you have created for yourself is an escape route into the life you wish you had. Wow, Eliza, I never really realized how dumb you truly are. You have the audacity to insult me in my own home and punch me in the face with your words. You have learned absolutely nothing from me, you brute. Ah, uh, you never cared about me. No, darling, that's not completely true. I love you very much, and I find you fairly attractive when you actually take the time to groom yourself properly. I wish I was just dead. Just shoot me now. Now we both can finally agree on something that we want. Now can't we? Go to hell. See you there. She'll be back. She'll be back. I forgot my pearls. Oh, these? Team.